everyone, we have a quick unboxing of a Super Nintendo game. This is NFL Quarterback Club 96. And the reason why I chose this game is because it's cheap. Um, there's a lot out there. And this one's in really good condition. Unfortunately, I've looked for some unboxing videos and I really haven't seen anything that really satisfied me. At least not for Super Nintendo. A lot of console unboxings, but not really games. But anyway, here we go. So I'll open it up and see what's inside. Now, I apologize. So I can't figure out a way to hold the camera and open this at the same time. Okay, here we go, here's the game. And we can pull it open over here. So I can just slide everything out at once. Okay, nothing in there. Okay, so here's the game. Uh, this game does not come with a dust cover on the bottom, as Nintendo stopped doing that after a while. I think it was 1995, correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, and here are the inserts. We have a merchandise catalog, registration card, a giant poster like thing. I'll get into that in a little bit. Your usual Nintendo Power subscription thingy. How to use your SNES. No one reads that. I know I don't. And of course, the game manual. Okay, so that's that. And for that poster thingy, I thought this was a nice addition to any game. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but when I feel that a game has a lot of inserts, it feels like it's really a good game. Like it's worth it. Like they spent the time to make me enjoy what's in it. I don't know, it's just me. Okay, and the back side. Got some more game stuff and the giant Super Nintendo logo. Alright. Now for the game itself. No, it's nice. Sealed up. Sitting in a cardboard box. Comes in plastic. So I'll take that out. Okay, and here it is. Nothing out of the ordinary. But uh, along with this video, I will show you what's inside the cartridge for anyone who's curious. And to save time and embarrassment, I have another copy here. I did buy a whole bunch of these on eBay. I have one over here that I already opened up with a 3.8 millimeter security bit. You can get these relatively cheap anywhere. Okay, so pull the cover open after you remove the screws. And lo and behold, a chip. Big waste of space if you ask me. Okay, here we go. Here's the save battery and all the other junk that goes with it. And uh, I will post some pictures up, some high quality pictures, so you can view them later. I know you really can't see much in the video. But as far as that's concerned, that's it. Thanks for watching.